Hi, I'm Nicola Roach. You're watching The Cycling Dame. The 2022 Cyclocross World Championships will, of course, be held in the Centennial Park in Fayetteville, which is about a three kilometer long course. Incidentally, this was also the second round of the World Cup this year, where Quinton Hedermans, the Belgian rider, took the win. The facility itself, where the course is, is an absolutely astonishing one as it's built for cyclocross racing. This is a very rare feat to see, as many of the races in Belgium are just on farms, etc. As most courses, the start of this course starts with a tarmac straight and the riders then head towards the first sharp turn where we could potentially see a lot of movement and riders moving up the field. The next challenge on the course is a grassy descent continued by a wide stretch of road. This is then followed by the toughest part of the course, perhaps 17% steep uphill similar to what we actually had in Ostend last year at the Worlds on the beach. The riders then have to tackle a more technical part of the course, follow with a two off camber section, a small tunnel and a winding run through a section of wooden area. And the organizers have also thrown in a rocky area just for good measure to just force the riders off their bikes. Riders, however, are forced to stay on their feet as they hit a long staircase, which will really be testing the legs in the closing stages of the race, as we've seen in many of the World Cup races that riders really start to tire. The riders will then descend down a 21% descent from the top of the stairs, guiding them to the pits for a second time before taking on a section of corkscrew brims to finish the lap. And this is a relatively hard course, I would say, for this championships but it definitely will be a treat to see and it does look like it could favor the smaller riders such as Eli Yudisabid, Tom Pecock and Lars van der Haar but more on that in a sec. This course is also barely different to the very characteristic Austin course we had last year that was on the beaches of Austin so it definitely will be a bit different than last year. <laughs> <laughs> 